there's a tremendous amount of value captured in paper and plastic and metal that right now is lost at the landfill. The trouble is, the value of this material is really eroded by the cost of sorting it out in these recycling centers. Today's technology requires a tremendous amount of manual labor to ensure high purities of materials. But now that's changing. And what that means is that previous operations that were done manually and maybe done a little haphazardly can now be systematized, controlled, and automated. technology that AMP has developed in this vision system is that it perceives objects that are potentially bent, deformed, folded, crushed, just like you and I would if we were looking at the materials in these sorting facilities. So it's using the same kind of perception and logic as a human being. What we're able to do is not only quantify and sort how many coffee cups there are, but we could also report how many Starbucks cups there are. Robotics was started with the idea that robotics and artificial intelligence can change the fundamental economics of the recycling process. Today we have systems deployed all around the world sorting construction and demolition, electronic and municipal solid waste. 